guys, today I'm going to do my April TBR. So my April plans are a little bit boring, I gotta say, but I just need to get this shit done. So I'm doing another TBR just so that I can hold myself accountable, which obviously doesn't always work, but April should be a month where I should read. Not a lot but like definitely should be way more successful than March. And I do think that I can get done with this whole TBR in April. So I'm doing this so that I can hold myself accountable, so that I can watch this back and be like, this is what you wanted to read, do it. So first of all, I want to finish Obsidio by Amy Kaufman and Jake Kristoff. I'm almost halfway done and I just need to finish this. I mean, it has over 600 pages, but a lot of the pages are quicker than a normal book because of its kind of different format. I am enjoying it so far, I'm not loving it, but definitely enjoying it so far, it's entertaining. And yeah, I know for sure I will finish it, probably the first thing I will finish in April, but putting it on the list because holding myself accountable. And it always makes me feel good if I've finished a couple of books on my TBR, then it makes me more motivated to read the other books on my TBR. So this is what I'm putting on the list because I know I will finish it, so that will make me feel motivated for more. Then I want to finish Reign of the Fallen by Sarah Glenn Marsh. I already started this as well, but I don't think I'm very far into it. Probably under 100 pages. And I... well, I don't really have an opinion on it yet, but it's not really something that's keeping me very engaged. I'm not really motivated to pick it up, so we'll see where that goes. And then I also want to finish Set the Stage by Karis Walsh, another book that I have already started. I think I might be like 15% into it, and this is kind of a short book, so I'm also sure I can finish this. And this is actually an arc that I got from Ned Grelly months ago that I just finally need to read. And then once again, I have the three arcs that come out in May that I sadly did not manage to read in March. That's All of This Is True, Fury Born, and Onyx and Ivory. These are definitely the three arcs that I have to read in April because they come out in May and I wanna be ready for when they come out. I wanted to try and read them in March, but I just didn't get there because March was much more stressful than I thought it would be. But I think in April I'm gonna be able to do it. And then I also wanna read Over Raging Tides by Jennifer Elysion. This is also an arc that I got just like a day before release, so it's not an arc that I have to get ready before a certain release date. But I definitely want to get to it as soon as possible, so it's not another one that's just kind of, you know, hanging around until I'm ready to read it, like set the stage. The series is actually called Lady Pirates, which is all that I needed to know for me to want to read this book. It's about a female pirate crew. I am fucking excited because pirates and Lady Pirates, even better. Perfect. I, I'm excited. And while we're at the topic of Lady Pirates, I hope to read The Unbinding of Mary Read by Miriam McNamara. Is that the author's name? Ugh, I'm not sure. This is a book that I've been highly, highly anticipating and it comes out in June. So, you know, I want to get to it because I, you know, actually want to read it early because I've been so excited about it and still haven't read it even though I've now been owning it for a couple of weeks. So that's apparently how this goes. But yeah, I'm super excited about this one and cannot wait because it's pirates, it's lady pirates, it's female, female romance lady pirates. Whew. Yes, but it's like lower priority because it only comes out in June. That's probably gonna end up being the book that I read first, just because I just said that. Mm. Anyway, these are my kind of boring plans for April. A lot of these books you have already heard me talk about, but as I said, I just need to hold myself accountable and this is just what we're gonna do. And hopefully in April, I will have read all of these. Like this is holding myself accountable. This is a strict TBR. Last month's TBR was kind of like, woof whatever, maybe I read this one or maybe I read the other one. This month is like, read these. There's no other way. There's like one way forward and it all goes through these books. Anyway, let me know if you have any plans for April and thank you so, so much for watching. I guess I'll see you soon. Bye!